When Keith told us about his vision for the truth to life, we were very excited. We felt immediately in our hearts that it was for a vision from God. Uh, there are several reasons that we think it's going to succeed. Uh, the first reason is that it mobilizes the whole church, enables just faithful, solid people within the church to have a tool that they can go out and be in, in the frontline church planting. The other reason I think it's going to succeed is because of, it's going to use technology. Uh, Brother Keith wants to get thousands of these audio players. We're recording these so that they can go in MP3 format. So instead of having to wait to train 10,000 people, these players are going to teach. So the people don't even have to be literate, they don't have to read, they don't have to learn something. They will be able to take this out there and just hold a whole service without any kind of training at all. Church in India is not grabbing every opportunity to evangelize the hitherto neglected 400,000 villages who never had the chance to hear the name of Jesus at least once in their life's path. I believe that 300, 400,000 villages in India still have no witness for Jesus. And uh, it is for this that Jesus died. My people, my Indian people, our village people, they will be blessed. And these lessons will have a wonderful impact on the lives of those dear ones. Maybe friends, you are there in Australia. You may not be able to come to India and you may not be able to visit these hundreds and thousands of villages and the people that are there in those villages. But let me tell you, with your prayers and with your support and with your financial backup, I'm sure that you would be reaching those hundreds and thousands of villages. And I'm sure that in the kingdom of God, God will appreciate you saying that, well done thou good and faithful servant. And because of you, see so many people have come from India and come from the villages into this kingdom. Thank you.